I've got a question, a little right. one. Uh, not to beat the, the uh, retirement fund thing and the withdrawal to death, but just as a hypothetical, if you're a physician and your money's sitting there doing really nothing for you in retirement, but you're thinking, well, as soon as I pull that out, somebody's going to sue me for looking at them wrong, which happens, and then it's a target. You're a target. You're always a target, but you're more of a target when cash is in flux. And well, my plan was to pull out what I need right before I need it, put it in the deal, but that won't I know protect you. That won't protect you. Okay, let me tell you, explain okay. to you about liability. You're, you're, you're hypothetically, you're a doctor asking this question, right? Correct. Okay, I've got, I've done more business with more doctors and more dentists and made more of them multi, multi millionaires than any other practice. Okay, here's the deal. In Texas, you can't sue a guy and take his 401k or his IRA from. Him, okay. So it's a, it's a safe haven. Here's what you do. I want you to go get yourself something called a limited family partnership. Because you need to understand this. If you took your money out and put it in an LLC, you cannot protect from, out, from inside out liability. I'm sorry, LLCs, corporations, they only protect from inside out liability. So in your practice, they sue you as a doctor. They can't get to you and your personal assets because they sue your practice. Does that Correct. make sense? Correct. If you own an apartment complex, they can sue your apartment complex, but they can't sue you. But that doesn't protect you from somebody suing you on what I call outside-in liability. If you drove down the street and killed somebody with your car, they could take your LLC away from you. Are you with me? Yes. So moving it out of that IRA or 401k into that LLC does not protect it like it was protected in the IRA and 401k. But here is what will. Go get yourself a limited family partnership, which means your family owns that, you don't. And now they can't sue you for that money because it's not yours, it belongs to somebody else. Great. Get yourself a good the attorney. The less that's mine, the better. <laughs> yes, exactly. You don't want it to be yours. You want it to belong to that. Now, another way is trust and stuff like that. But get a good attorney that knows how to do this stuff. But I'm just telling you, to think that you go out of the IRA of Fort Wayne, go into LLC, you're protected, not for you. That's kind of what I thought. Okay, you kill somebody as a doctor, they're going to go after everything you own, your home. Well, in Texas, they can't get your home, but, you know, you can't get your home, can't get your 401k and IRA, but they could get all your LLCs. You follow me? Correct. So don't set it up that way. Now, your, your limited family partnership, it will own the LLC that owns the property. Okay. All right? Thanks. Then you're going to be sweet, I guarantee you. All right. Well, I can't guarantee you. I'm not an attorney, so.